Hello and welcome to this auction video for this uh, lovely Vauxhall Insignia on an 11 plate. Super low mileage this one, just over 60,000 miles with an amazing full service history, very well uh, cared for and uh, lots of money spent on it, on maintenance, clutch, etc. bits and pieces over the years. I've got all the printouts for all of that and we'll take you through all the history when we get inside the vehicle but I've just had a drive up and down the dual carriageway and can confirm this is a uh, lovely drive uh, nothing really untoward to report at all no real damage on this vehicle uh, it does look like there is kind of some damage here but it's not it's just dirt coming out the back of the uh, around the brake lens there just a, a small minor thing I would point out if you see anything like that on the photos um, yeah I've done a load of photos inside of out done the uh, tire tread depths loads of life left on those tires and all the alloys looking in quite nice condition but anyway i'm going to take you for a uh, little walk around and we'll see whatever damage we can find and give you a look on the inside and out and give it a good going over so let's have a look at it nothing to report much really at all a little scratch here on the arch a little one here so there's been a tiny little bit of contact there I would say the front end in general just has a few stone chips, age related, nothing really on toward. Bit of a kind of contact there at some point in its life, but the bonnet isn't really looking too bad at all. All looking quite clean and tidy. Headlights are looking nice as well. Fog lights are really working as well, which is nice. But yeah, no real problems there to report. Let's come around to the other side here now have a look all looking nice and tidy and presentable a little bit of some scratching coming down here a little bit of a scuff there on the on the arch but yeah, you've got to kind of look hard to see that the mirror is looking pretty clean apart from a little mark on the top there passenger door looking tidy a few little marks here probably picked up in the supermarket your usual wear and tear tear marks around the door handles Passenger door again looking nice and clean and tidy. Your usual wear and tear around the handles. Uh, this rear panel here is looking all nice. Tiniest little bit of rust coming up on the arch there. But I'm really picking always a tiny little scratch there on the uh, side of the bumper. A few little scratches just on the corner here. We have got um, parking sensors and a tow bar. Your usual kind of wear and tear marks on the load area there the actual boot door is looking in good order as is the tail lights uh, yeah all looking good there no cracks i can see no real visible damage maybe one or two little kind of scuffs here or there tiny little scratches maybe um, but all looking quite clean and presentable uh, coming around to this rear passenger door always looking good can't actually see any damage on there at all. A little bit of dirt there. Nothing really going on. Some very light surface scratches going on. And your usual kind of wear and tear around the door handle and entrance to the door with a few chips here and there. But on from that, the actual driver's door is looking quite tidy, as is the mirror. Again, looking tidy, a few dead, dead bugs. Let's have a look on the inside. I've already been around the inside and I can tell you it does all look good. Um, please excuse my bits and pieces here. So yeah, the uh, load area is looking good and the tailgate lifts no problem, supports its weight. And we've got a nice space saver under there. Spare, let's have a look in the back seat here. So we've got manual windows, uh, tinted windows on the back. Door cards are looking tidy. Back of the seats looking tidy, as is the carpets and the seats as well are looking good. Uh, it does look like quite bad actually on my uh, camera here, but it's not looking too bad, but could benefit from a bit of a clean up here on the back seats. Um, I'm sure I'll come back to its former glory with a little bit of work. Um, again, tinted window, door card looking good. Back of the seats, all nice. And these seats, as I say, just could benefit from just a little bit of a cleaning. Um, let's have a look around the passenger side here so we've got electric windows and mirrors they all work fine door cards looking good interior is looking nice seats are looking good 
and lots of history, full service history. So I'll take you through that in a sec. Let's hop around into the driver's seat and we'll check for any warning lights, etc. Let's first of all have a look at this door card. Again, tinted window, door card looking good. Electric windows and electric mirror. Right, let's hop in. Turn all the lights off. Disengage your handbrake, and we've got a mileage of 63,010 miles, so super low mileage there. Um, and yeah, nothing really on to war to report. Got all your usual bits and pieces. Aircon does work and it does pipe out nice cold air. Uh, we also have two keys, and I've just noticed, well, it's literally just happened to me, the um, one of the keys have just fell out of its place on this uh on one of the keys here let me see if i can flip it back around there we go so it's just uh come out of the little locator there and that might need gluing in place or something i don't know but yeah it is two keys but one is a little bit broken so let me take you through the startup sequence again No warning lights okay so let's have a look at all this we've got locking wheel nuts all your little books and a wallet and some printed invoice from us at drive oxwell and western supermare and let's have a look at the history here so we've got a stamp there in 2012 2013 14 and 15 if you want to study these more so please do have a look at our photos uh, attached because I've taken photos of all this 2016, 17, and 18, and 19, 2 and 19, uh, 20, 21, and 22, and 23. So there we go, full service history, which is nice to see. And um, we've got some recent invoices here um, done in the last two or three years. So it's had a clutch kit three years ago with a very uh, large bill there of over a thousand pounds. So clutch kit, kit etc. Again, if you want to see more of this, please check out the photos. There's photos of all of it. And also uh, some more work carried out here um, in 2020. Again, for another big bill of 845 pounds. Um, trying to see what it is. Drive belt, belt, belt tensioner. Uh, gear shift lever so yeah, it's had a bit of work uh, 11th service there carried out in 2022 and um, some springs rear suspension near side, side spring uh, replaced um, uh, rear suspension anyway yeah that was done in 22 as well and 2021 uh, another service there so lots of invoices full service history all all stamped up which is nice to see uh yeah all looking rather tidy and presentable and clean in here let's have a look under the bonnet and i can already report you it's looking nice and clean and tidy and all sounds as it should no nasty oily smells or anything like that and uh did accelerate very well up and down the dual carriageway all looking very clean. Let you have a look and listen. And there we go, guys. Okay, rather nice, low mileage, full service history. Insignia. Okay, hope you've enjoyed the uh, video and happy bidding.